Hi guys, what's up? It's Kaylee, and I'm gonna show you guys my e.l.f. haul that I did on Cyber Monday, which was about like a week ago. This was the only makeup I got on Cyber Monday, and I have it in this little, uh, not little, it's more like a big makeup case. There's already a mirror inside. It is epic, I know. I When I saw this on e.l.f., I'm like, are you serious? Because I think this was, I think, <laughs> I think this was only $3 or something. I used the code CYBER50, I believe. So everything, literally everything on the website was 50% off. If you spend $35, you get free shipping. So obviously, I was gonna spend $35 so I could get the free shipping and more products. I like to completely remove everything off my face with a makeup remover. So I decided to try out these two and both got Got really good reviews. I'm gonna say everything got really good reviews because I really don't buy something that has bad reviews online. I like these better than the Neutrogena ones that I use. I used one last night just to try it out, this one, which is the regular cleansing cloths. I will say though that they are freaking huge. Like I'm gonna have to start splitting them into thirds I think to use them because you don't need a full wipe for your entire face. Like no joke, they are huge. I'm gonna pull one out for you guys so I can show it to you exactly how big these things are. Oh! Like, look at this, you don't, you don't need this. <laughs> My voice is cracking, but you don't need this for your entire face, so just go ahead and rip that baby in half. And then this is the other one that I got, the exfoliating cleansing cloth. So there's 10 sheets in there, but I figured it would be nice if I wanted to skip out on my Clarisonic Mia and just remove my makeup and exfoliate at the same time. I thought it would be a pretty cool thing to do. So I am a big fan of e.l.f. brushes. I love them. This one right here, this is the e.l.f. complexion brush. It's always nice to have extras in your makeup collection, honestly, because when one's dirty, you can use the other one. I've used it for bronzer, I've used it for blush, I've used it for powder all over the face. And I decided to try out this brush. This is the e.l.f. Mineral Powder Brush. This is, I think, the MAC 109. I'm thinking that's what it says. Is this not, like, almost an exact dupe? Don't even lie to me right now. Is this not an exact dupe? Seriously, this thing is like a freaking dollar. This is like $25. I also decided to get the e.l.f. Kabuki Face Brush. And uh, I know this brush has gotten a lot of love over the past few years from e.l.f. I mean, everyone uses it on YouTube, except for me, obviously. I've never tried it before. And I, ha I just decided, I'm like, you know what? Since everything's 50% off, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and get it and try it out. This is officially now my softest brush that I own. No joke, this is so soft. It's literally like a baby's bottom. This reminds me of a koala bear. That's why I like it. It's so fluffy. I have four lipsticks that I got from e.l.f. to show you guys, and these are all from the same collection. Got amazing reviews online, so I had to give it a try. These are the e.l.f. moisturizing lipsticks. So this first one is called Ravishing Rose. The texture of it is really creamy, it's really moisturizing, and it doesn't have a ton of sheen to it, like shimmer, which I like. Cheeky, and this has some shimmer to it. This is a really nice nude color. And let's see, the third one is called Red Carpet. I had to get a red. I love my reds for like really dramatic looks. So there is Red Carpet. And then the very last one I got, I think might be my favorite, is called Rosy Go Round. It's kind of similar to the first one, Ravishing Rose. It's a little bit different. It's a little more on the pink side. Ravishing Rose is a little bit more nude. So I also saw these and decided to pick them up because, um, I don't know, I feel like I need some more minerals in my life. This is the e.l.f. Mineral Booster Tinted Powder. This one has more of a bronzy finish to it, so I was planning on using it to contour my face lightly, like on the days where I want a more natural look. The e.l.f. Mineral Booster Shimmer Powder. And this one I wanted to use like on my cheekbones, down the center of my nose, just anywhere where I want a really nice shimmery highlight. I decided to get these e.l.f. Baked Highlighters as well, because I love highlighters. One of them has more of a peachy color to it, the other one is more more pink. So this one is called Blush Gems, the one that's a little bit more peachy. Um, I will say though, because I swatched these when I first got them in the mail, that it takes a lot to get it off. Like I feel like I have to rub it forever to even get a swatch for you guys. But you know what, I guess that's kind of nice at the same time, because you don't want way too much on your face. You always want to take it easy on the highlighter. But there's that. And then this one here, this more pinky one, is called Pink Diamonds. So 
So I'll swatch that for you guys too. God, these are these are beautiful. Once you get the color off, you, it's honestly really, really pretty. I am a huge, absolutely huge fan of these eyeliners from e.l.f. This is called the Brightening Eyeliner Pencil. I have it in black and I literally use it all the time. You guys have seen me use it in a million different tutorials. But I wanted to get it in a brown color as well. This is called Coffee. I decided to pick up the e.l.f. Mineral Eyeshadow Primer, which I did use today underneath of my eyeshadows. This is a great, cheap primer that works pretty much exactly the same as the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, in my opinion, and it's only a dollar. So that's what it looks like. And it comes off uh, kind of like skin color, and then you just blend it in. This is the e.l.f. Lip Liner and Blending Brush, and it's in the color natural. So one side is the lip liner here, which you can see, and I swatched it for you right there. And on the other side, it has a little brush, so you can blend it out so it's not so... Hold on, everything's backwards. <laughs> so you can blend it out so it's not so harsh, and I thought that was kind of a nice touch. So the very last thing that I got was this right here, which is the eyebrow kit from e.l.f. I use this angle brush side here, and I get the wax, and I put that on first, and then I pick up the powder and put that on next, and your eyebrows are pretty much good to go. It's really nice. And mine is in the color medium. All right, guys, so that is it for this video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed my haul. I promise you guys I will do another haul video on all the clothes that I got from Cyber Monday, but if you ended up buying anything from e.l.f. for Cyber Monday, let me know down in the comments below. I want to know what you guys got. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, and uh, I guess I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my vlog channel too. I'll put the link right after this. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! We've been playing this game ever since we got in. Like, Stop, Grandma. Stop. Like, <laughs> this is what happened. In the car, he kept grabbing my leg and tickling me. And I kept telling him to stop, and he wouldn't stop. So now that we're in public, I'm purposely grabbing his leg. <laughs> Go ahead, put it on. Actually, can I wear one? I want to be the blue one. It only fits little kids. How did yeah. you get this on your head? I have a little There's kid There's no way my head is bigger than yours. <laughs> you look cute like that, though. <laughs> That is everything that I got from Elf. I promise you guys I would do this video. And then I also just decided, I decided to get the Elf Kabuki fake fake brush. <laughs> this first one is called is called ish called <laughs> Ravishia. I cannot speak at all. Okay. Um. Get off my face.